The natural form of the minor scale produces a major chord on scale degrees 3 and 7. While 3 is used similarly in both major and minor keys, the 7 chord is unique to the minor mode and requires special treatment. Because 7 also sounds like the dominant of 3, any progression involving these two chords risks sounding like a modulation is underway. The mere presence of 7 also undermines the minor mode because it eliminates the raised leading tone, which is instrumental in establishing the key center. Composers can use this ambiguity to achieve a broader palette of harmonic colors, as well as to play with the expectations of listeners. Consider the following example. The three chord here functions as a harmonic turning point. If we continue the phrase as follows, we hear seven in retrospect as five of the new key, C major. If we continue the phrase differently, however, we hear the entire phrase in the key of A minor. In this example, Schumann uses 7 in root position to create harmonic ambiguity that is only resolved at the moment of cadence. Composers can use various techniques to achieve different degrees of modulatory effects. One common strategy for attenuating the sense of modulation is to invert 7 so as to form a stepwise bass line. This gives the impression of a tonic prolongation in which 3 substitutes for 1 6. And moving immediately from 3 to a predominant chord attenuates the feeling of modulation even further. Owing to its potential as the dominant of 3, 7 is often accompanied by its chordal 7th. This amplifies our impression of this chord functioning as 5-7 in the key of C major, rather than 7 in the key of A minor. A less ambiguous use of 7 in minor involves a tonic prolongation between two root position 1 chords. Even in this case, however, we might feel as though an impending move to a major key is thwarted by the entrance of 565. Again, composers can use this ambiguity to great effect, as in this excerpt from Schubert's Der Schatzgräber. Here, the key of D minor is briefly undermined by the C major chord in measure 2, which we can understand in retrospect as 7-7. 